Good evening. Nine News cameras have captured an alleged drink driver's dangerous detour on the southeastern freeway. Police say he dumped his car and dashed into the scrub in a brazen attempt to avoid a random breath test, adding to authorities' despair as the road toll climbed to seven in just six days. It's not even lunchtime, but police cast the net on the southeastern freeway and immediately hook a suspect. Oh, my God. No, honestly, this is Australian. And police say utterly reckless. Straight through behind those pine trees. The 37-year-old driver from Callington allegedly blowing more than three times the legal limit, accused of dumping his car in the scrub and making a run for it in an attempt to avoid detection. Oh, I don't care, mate. I just want to exactly the sort of behaviour angering police. You are putting your life, but more importantly, you're putting other people's lives in, uh, in absolute uh, jeopardy. Making matters worse, Operation Distraction, cracking down on mobile phone use behind the wheel, has again stung an average of 50 drivers a day last month. We've had over 1,500 um, expiation notices issued and uh, it's another sign that people seem to be very slow in getting the message that something like using your mobile phone is a serious issue in terms of road safety. Seven people have lost their lives in the past six days. Last night a cyclist died when her bike collided with a truck here on Swanport Village Road near Murray Bridge. A 42-year-old mother of two from Swanport leaving a small town to grieve and bringing the state's road toll to 82, pushing close to 10 more than this time last year. What um, the community needs to realise is those figures are human lives that are, have been tragically cut short. Tracy Alexander, Nine News.